Hello ladies, welcome to my channel. Thank you very much for clicking on this video. If you're a new visitor to my channel, welcome again. I usually do um, unboxing or review of luxury items, shoes, bags, accessories, etc. And if you are my return subscriber and supporter to my channel, Thank you so very much guys. I just recently hit 1000k and I already posted on my community post that I'm planning to do my next giveaway and I give you options what you want to choose for my next giveaway. Please visit my community post and do your selections. Today video is going to be unboxing of one of my items from the wish list. I'm gonna link also my wish list video somewhere over here. If you wanna uh, watch that video, please follow uh, link somewhere over here. <laughs> and uh, most likely also I'm gonna leave the link at the end of the video, like you know those end of the video cards. So please follow those links as well. But as I mentioned, today is going to be unboxing of my, one of my wish list, and I got this item from Luisa Villaroma. I got major deal on this item. This is something that not quite often you can see on YouTube communities in North America. But oops, holding up. <laughs> but I really want to get this item for a while. So let's just do unboxing together. I already obviously unpackaged everything because when you receive items from Luisa Villaroma, you have very limited windows of opportunity return or exchange. So this is obviously the receipt. And that's roughly the packaging that it comes from Luisa Villaroma. I actually have, I already purchased like several items from Luisa Villaroma and overall my experience are very, very positive. I love it. But there is some hits and misses, especially with their customer service. And here's the beautiful dust bag. And on the dust bag, you can see it says Valextra. It's not quite common luxury uh, brands that you see in North America. And what I like about the dust bag, even like, you know, the, the strings over here, it's also leather. And here is my selection. Woohoo! <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, so this is my selection. It, like, you know, I usually try to stay away from the bright colors. <laughs> Gee, <laughs> check my uh, outfit today. I'm completely bold, scarlet red, but I'm trying to introduce more and more colors into my wardrobe and obviously into my handbag collection. And this is my Valextra inside in mini size. This is the mini size, but to be frank, it's not that mini. So just to give you a quick comparison, here is my Chanel uh, vanity case in the medium size, and you can see it's pretty much the same size. Oh no, I apologize. I think it's a small size because then there is also mini, if I'm not mistaken. But this is the between the smallest one and the largest in the vanity case. So pretty much the same size so you can see and I would say it's approximately would fit the same uh, amount and here is the comparison between true mini in Chanel you can see how the Chanel mini actually looks completely tiny comparable to this uh, mini so they call it mini but obviously you can see that it will fit a decent amount of um, items and let me just quickly come a little bit closer to the camera and show you in and out of this bag because this bag is perfection when you look at the glazing guys i cannot tell you enough how the craftsman's craftsmanship on this bag is exceptional like if i would compare the craftsmanship on this bag with any other brand i cannot even compare to the chanel sorry chanel because especially lately i don't know and louis vuitton it's a good company etc but the craftsmanship it's getting worse and worse if I could compare this one with the craftsmanship, it would be only Hermes because everything is absolute perfection, 
perfection the way it's done anyway let me just stop rumbling and come a little bit closer to the camera and show to you everything okay so i'm coming a little bit closer to the camera so here is the closer look at the bag and i will show you cool features how this um, uh, unsnapping so you kind of pulling this uh, tag down and removing this um, what do you call like you know it's not really deering but something and this is how it slides down and closing very cool feature to be frank so and um, that's the closer look of the lock itself and how you on button you kind of slide this to the side and so inside you have one large compartment with the uh, one slide pocket at the back right there there is some um, quality cards etc that comes with the Valextra and inside it's also leather lined over here also you can see the marking from the Valextra which is the um, production code it says Valextra right there and I would say it, um, made in Italy so it says made in Italy Valextra and production code and the leather they they have several different variety of the leather and this one is the grain leather I choose specifically grain leather because I want it to be a bit more durable the hardware on this bag is uh, silver or palladium plated in other words and uh, you have top handle and obviously you have um, detachable shoulder strap it can be either shoulders or crossbody so uh, where you can see indication of outside of the Valextra it's only on this little pool right there let me just show you hopefully it will focus it says Valextra right there in that little pool or the part of the lock that's about it that's the only part that shows uh, Valextra, I would say. And as I already mentioned, inside the bag, right there, you can see it says Valextra. Uh, let me see if there is a, there is a four studs at the bottom. So you can see there is a four studs at the bottom. I, they still have protective plastics. Obviously, I'm going to remove that one. And I want to come a little bit closer, guys, and show you the glazing this glazing is perfection look at this glazing oh my goodness look at this glazing i never seen any glazing in such quality oh my gosh perfection this bag is absolute perfection i have to stop saying word perfection because <laughs> it's already getting a little bit annoying even for myself most likely right now i'm gonna insert my modeling shots and while my modeling shots are running i just want to share with you my thoughts on my uh, valextra inside in mini uh, size um, first and most if i'm not mistaken this color called um aquamarine or like some really fancy name for the blue and the color as i said once again it's quite saturated and uh, almost unique looking color i really love it it's a second bag in my collection with the silver hardware um, the first one with the silver it's my chanel mini so this is the second one in the silver hardware and i absolutely absolutely love this color it, it's gorgeous it's absolutely beautiful color i was a little bit nervous before i was buying this color but now thanks god that i actually um you know push myself to be a little bit bold and actually purchase pur purchasing this bag originally on my wish list i was kind of into more uh, burgundy color maybe but then I decided, you know, if I want to go with a new brand, go big and bold. And I decided to go uh, with this, such a bold color. Summer once again coming upon us. And I think it's absolutely perfect color for summer. First and most, you can wear with any denim. 
any white color this would be a perfect accent uh, to any white color and then you know no matter what color you're gonna wear this is just going to be a gorgeous compliment because it's a solid uh, blue color little bit of history of Valextra. Valextra was established in 1937. It's a very, very old brand and they were originally also doing uh, luggages, pretty much the same as a Louis Vuitton. By now they're still doing briefcases and luggages, but now also they're doing lots of handbags as well. Everything was originally pretty much almost of the exotic leather, but now they're moving into the calfskin, etc. But they still have some exotic exotic leathers in their collection and they are pretty pricey so I was holding myself on purchasing this bag on a full price and there wasn't like really sell per se it was no sell it was on Luisa Via Roma one of those hours when they sent you um, like you know a quick note from Luisa Via Roma if you want to purchase in this hour or so you get extra discount from Luisa Via Roma and that's how I got this bag I got 30% discount which is hefty hefty amount of discount on the bag like that so uh, originally this bag was uh, I think about 37 uh, hundred of Canadian dollars and I end up getting this bag for 2700 which is like a thousand dollars discount which is exceptional really exceptional so as I said they established in 1937 and um, their mantra is uh, a logo with no logo <laughs> so all their bags are pretty much are very very uh, recognizable but they never put any logo as i show you there is just a little writing on the side which just says valextra and that's about it but you cannot uh, confuse this bag with any other brand like their snapping of the um, strap is once again unique i never seen any other company doing this kind of snapping it's it's like guys I'm so glad that I got bold and purchased this bag this bag is absolutely perfection I love 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 this bag so I gonna maybe in the next uh, few weeks or so give you a little bit further uh, details about this bag uh, what fits inside I gonna also list in the description box below the dimensions of this bag just from top of my head I believe it's 22 centimeters by 15 centimeters by 10 10 centimeters but I will give you in the description box in the centimeters and in the inches as well um, that's about it if you have any questions please do not hesitate leave your questions and comments below and uh, um, I will gladly answer all your questions and concern uh, when it comes to this specific bag. As I said, in the next few weeks, I'm going to do um, most likely what fits inside. If you're interested, guys, once again, leave your comments below. And maybe uh, at the end of the summer, I'm going to do um, a review on wear and tear because I want to take a few months of actually using this bag before I'm going to post any uh, review on wear and tear of this uh, bag thank you very much guys for watching i hope that you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed the video please don't forget to hit that subscribe button because i definitely want to see you again on my channel if you like the video don't forget to put like share my videos with your friends and again thank you very much for visiting my channel and i hope to see you again on my channel thank you very much and bye bye